I'm just so relieved, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, Stig is such a fantastic jumper. I think we saw that today. And he breezed around the cross country yesterday very quickly, a little bit too quickly. And um, I thought he would feel very bright and easy today, but actually he was a little bit tired. So I didn't do too much warm up, but he was tremendous in the arena. I tried my hardest and today it was good enough. So, so I'm very pleased with that. So amazing. So as a Chinese athlete, I've been competing for quite a few years now. Um, you know, standing next to the Chinese show jumping team and Rao Jiayi and the dressage team, I feel quite old now. <laughs> and, but for me, I made a decision many years ago that I had the opportunity to uh, represent China on the international scene. And it's very difficult as an, as an athlete to compete internationally, but also here on the domestic circuit with horses. To have this rare opportunity to be here at our home championships, at, at an Asian Games, and to win, a, win not only team gold, but individual, is very special. It's so exciting. We have, uh, in the dressage team, we had uh, two older generation riders, uh, and then we have a young, uh, upcoming superstar, Sarah Rao, Rao Jiayi, who's actually based in our stables in the UK. Um, Together they won the team silver medal, which was absolutely brilliant. I'm so proud of them. Um, the eventing team, okay, at the moment we are all the same generation, um, all in our 30s. Uh, but you look at the show jumping team and they're all under 25, they're young, they're dynamic, they very much represent the next generation of riders coming through. And I think for Chinese equestrian sports, this championship is, I feel, going to prove a key milestone to demonstrating that China and that generation is the bright future for Chinese equestrianism.